Previously, we did Kellogg's memories, and I know what you're all thinking. In case you're wondering, the Diamond City radio signal comes in loud and clear here in Good Neighbor. And that Travis? Man, he got good. Uh, cheers for pointing that out. Anyway, did I get the Institute pistol? Yes. Yes, I did. I was somehow able to pick this up during the memory. Kind of a wee odd thing, but it's pretty cool. Also, we've got the silver submachine gun. I think I've got the silver uh, shroud armor and hat. So you get a lot of agility and perception from wearing it. Plus, the damage resistance is whoa, it's bonkers. Is it though? Is it bonkers if I combine like everything I'm wearing? What's my chest piece at? 24. That's pretty good. It is pretty good. Right, so, Eddie Winter, your reign of terror is over. We are going to listen to the last Eddie tip before going on and taking him out. Oh, her notes. Eddie Winter, self-inflicted ghoul, criminal kingpin, age 200, offences, too many to count, location under Andrew Station, sealed in a 10-digit code. Uh, the hollow tapes hold the key to Winter's bunker. Each tape is one piece of the entry code, ten tapes, nine left. One was found in the uh, police station, obviously before Dance and the Brotherhood showed up. Possible remaining hollow tape locations, Commonwealth Police Departments, the Band TFL. Uh, so, uh, it doesn't give you much else other than that. Body does have... Where's the Eddie Winter tapes? Oh, did I hand them all over? Oh, no. No way that's how that works. Yeah, all the tapes are gone. Oh, well, I suppose Nick needed them, and it would make sense to remove them from your inventory. It is a shame I didn't listen to the first one, but... Uh, anyway, we'll bust on straight into Andrew Station. Say hello to Eddie Winter. Ooh. I think there might be something deadly at the other side of this. Huh? Sounds like it! Shoot him! Shoot him all! You are not the first thing I thought I would come across, but... Oh dear. Oh dear. Ooh ah. Yeah! Come on in! I'll take it. Oh. I hear a vertibird! A little too far away to be of any use to me. Maybe it's for too soon. Don't quit, do ya? Anyone up here? No? Where are you all fighting? Must be over towards the castle. Oh. Uh, you thought I was going that way. Oh. Wah. Oh, you want to go hand to hand? Oh, that's alright, I'll play fair. Nah, not really. Oh, it must be that we Raider Plaza again they're fighting. Seems to be quite rife. With uh, Brotherhood dipping in and out of there. Whoa! I don't know where Nick is. Nick? Admit, he's giving me more of a run for my money than I yeah, normally get. Now, what do you have for me in uh, cavalier armor? Nah, not what we want. This is for terminals and spotlights. Yeah, I need to 
turret control. Okay, we've cleared Andrew's station, and I'm not sure where my uh, where my Nick Valentine is going to. Well, I am a lot richer than I was. I heard an explosion, so that means the vertebrate died, which means the Brotherhood <laughs> might all be dead. Which means there might be a lot of items for us to pick up. I consider in the lack of Nick, wherever Nick is, we should go investigate. What was this wee spot? Or it was the square. Either or, it's very quiet, so I don't think it was happening here. Oh no, never mind. Area secure? I'm the one that came in. Well, that's, that's what I expect to see more of. Normally a death claw, like, binding about here. Ah, oh, it must just be random. Random chance. I remember I was looting this one day for an unmarked location and I seen the death claw out front and I was like, no, nah, really? <laughs> you here? Crazy. Okay. Um Question. Where's the Brotherhood guys? Where'd the vertebrate come down? I know there's raiders over there, so he just didn't. Ah! Here we go. Gonna search the crash site for bodies. No, given the widespread of area, it might. Ooh, it's not gonna be difficult at all. Oh! What's that? Ooh. Didn't fight over this direction. got injured by her trigger assault rifle. A laser rifle, I'm sure. There's something silly I picked up. Hunting rifle heavy and doesn't have much. Okay. Where did those Brotherhood of Steel people go to? Okay, so we know... Is that a body there? Oh, it's your man I killed last time, isn't it? That's Parker Quinn, yeah. <laughs> Don't try and scam me, boy! It's just very odd. There's no one about. Just want to do one more wee scout of the area here. Nah, I never found any remains of Brotherhood soldiers. Only the Vertibird, so... Perhaps it was just one patrolman and he just wandered off. Because you know the way they do that. They kind of just wander off. Where is Nick? I'm going to fast travel back into this place because I'm so confused as to where he is. Waiting. We should head over to the Nakano residence when we can. Find out what their case is about. Yeah, we'll do that in a bit, Nick. He, he did appear, by the way. Just as I walked in. He 
job, Nick. Triggering all that. Floor safe. Nice. Awesome. Does mean I I just can't move, but super light soon. Sweet. Something up. Set him as that. Powering up. Will he not attack? On duty. Such a kill weapon he's got. Come on, Bedekron. Tell you what, wall has bonuses. Yeah, that's one way to get that. Yeah. Hey, Valentine. something over just to keep me going here. Yeah, he's pretty determined, isn't he? Still, here's me, just... Not that it's not. Protect and serve. Well, new plan. chance to freeze the enemy when you block their attack. Yeah, it's alright, I guess. Is this going to be the spotlights again? Hey, Valentine. Funeral. Finally time oh. for Damn. Right, Nick, come here. Come here. I can't wait to see the look on okay. what's left Apparently, of Apparently, Nick doesn't want to slow down. That's that's okay. We'll, we'll work with it. A few silly items I can drop that probably make up the carry weight. Got it. We're currently not getting from you, Nick. But... Fuck it. Prioritize just ammunition at this point. Ooh, what is behind you? That's it. Yeah, I'll take all of that. Bobby pens, nothing else of note. Protectrons kind of showed up now. Another quantum here. Not a bad wee haul so far. It's a side cupboard. Someone's coming. Look. You all right, Nick? I look like it hurt. Alright. Okay. 
fucked off. Hey, I thought I saw something. Got him! Ow. <laughs> the headless reader. has to be some of the most uh, three full tech lunch boxes now in a very small area that's, that's a bad pickup nice Close quarters, is it, Nick? I guess so. Nick seems to know where he's going, so... Oh. Hey, the boxing ring. Nick kills that. <laughs> Say what you want about the Raiders, they definitely have their own society going on here. Very quiet, don't you think? Eerily quiet? I ain't no way I'm left the news. Pipes, no. You would have thought there'd be raiders here, like. Anything I can lug for you? Nick. I never would have made it this far without you. Can't wait to see the look on what's left of Eddie's face. Okay, we we get it, we get it, Nick. You're not helping me carry anything. I get it. Guess we'll be dropping the shotguns. That lock of his. I think I'll just let Nick kill him. I think that's one of the options. That filthy toad's right on the other side of that door. Why don't you do the honor? Sure. One nine five three seven two eight four zero six. The fuck? Who the fuck are you? Yay, it's him. Hey, it's all right. I'm just passing through. Passing through? A secure underground bunker? Just how the fuck did you get? No. No way. Not after all this time. Don't tell me you actually cracked my code. In the hollow tapes? <laughs> well, hey. It's only been what? 200 years? <laughs> well, look. I'm not sure what you thought you'd find. Gold, jewels, the secrets of the universe. But you get me. One guy. A ghoul, I guess you'd call me. Just living, surviving, and what I got, you can't have. That code? <laughs> it was a joke. I just wanted to prove how dumb those feds were. Turns out, pretty dumb. So take your asses someplace else. I'm not going anywhere until I get what I came for. Yeah? And what's that? And who are you, huh? You look kind of familiar. But what are you, some kind of robot? Is that what it's like out there now? A world of robot overlords? I knew it. The name's Valentine. Nick Valentine. Remember me? Valentine? The cop? Is that who you're supposed to be? Sorry, pal, but you ain't Nick Valentine. You're just some kind of, uh, machine. You killed my fiance, Jennifer Lands. There's some crimes even you can't get away with, Winter. <laughs> the fiance? You mean Valentine's fiance. Pretty girl. A shame what happened to her. But hey, you? Or, you know, the real Valentine? He should have backed off when he had the chance. But what gives, Robot Man? Why do you even care? 
Some girl gets whacked 200 years ago, and you come into my home acting like a hard guy? Christ, look at you. You're not even alive. Then I guess I'm in good company. You ain't not. I guess they got wise and folded. <laughs> Done. Nice. Yeah. There's one more thing I've got to do. I, I wouldn't mind the company. There we go. And his pace, 50% more limb damage. Don't know why he's got such a nasty looking. Look at that scope. Company, if you wanted to tag along. Follow Nick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna follow Nick. Just after I let Eddie's things. Desk fan! Even Eddie had one. Tells you a lot, doesn't it? He had soup, he had Nuka Cola. Suppose he didn't really need to drink anything, so. No free game now. Cooler hat. To Claire. Who's Claire? Claire. It's me. Eddie. It's been too long, I know. But I'm okay. We're okay. I know it's weird, me disappearing just when the heat died down. But there's a reason. What we talked about? It's happening. Soon. Bombs. Missiles. I don't know what. But the end is coming. I can't even tell you how much I paid my cloak and dagger friend for this info. So I guess me building that shelter was a smart idea after all, huh? But look, baby. There is... Uh, one more thing. The reason I haven't been around for a while... Go take her the neck. brothers at Wicked Shipping? The ones smuggling the radioactive material? I put the screws to them. Got some of the stuff. I've been working with this doctor in East Boston. Guy's a fucking genius. Listen, I know it sounds crazy, but he had this theory. The right kind of radiation exposure at the right amounts, it can change human cells. Mutate them. Baby, I can live forever. Yeah, I know. It could kill me. I'm willing to chance it, but I can't risk losing you. So I'm the guinea pig. And I've been getting treatments. But don't worry. I'm fine. More than fine. I feel great. Amazing, even. I think this crazy shit's really working. Eventually, this war will blow over. And when it does, I'm gonna walk out onto Boston and pick up where I left off. I'm gonna own the future. I'm assuming you'll be dead by then, of course. But let's not dwell on the negative. So look, you come to the sub shop tomorrow night. You and I will go into the shelter together. Seal it up and wait for the big kaboom. Just, uh, you might want to prepare yourself a little. Mentally and such, I look a little different now. But love is only skin deep, right? Oh, well, I'm guessing she never made it. So there's a terminal. I don't know if there's any information on it, but we'll open it nonetheless. And use all our ridiculous amount of tries. And even that, that's still not making it. But we get our tries reset, we get rid of, well, it says getting rid of duds, but as you can see, it's only getting rid of ones I already clicked on. I'm through. This was just all for the safe, it seems. All right, so Claire never made it, Eddie's dead, and we got what we came for. Let's go follow Nick. I don't know what's left, but may as well just go with him. Guess Nick ran into someone because he definitely killed them. Okay. Nothing like seeing your companion having just <laughs> ran through everyone. Also, it seems this comedian was not getting an easy break here. If we get loads of tomato tattoos thrown at him. This is underneath the uh, Slocum Joes. Or is I think it's Slocum Joes. I know, the second. Ingenious. Take anything else, so this will have to do another one. And dinner fork. How's all that? Is that that it? Okay. That's us. Let's get out of here. 
Ooh, Spooky's basement. Take the battered fedoras. Can still walk a bite, so I'm not up in the weight limit. <laughs> Where is Nick? There he is. This is it. In this spot, 200 years ago, one of Eddie's boys put a bullet in Jenny Land's back. Now Eddie's as dead as Jenny. And Nick. I... I'm at a loss. All I know is that without you, Eddie'd still be at large. I'm glad I could help. Seems like it meant a lot to you. You don't know the half of it. Winter was it. The only reminder left of the original Nick Valentine. The last proof outside of some long lost institute archive I was ever just a mechanical copy of some cop from a bygone era. I'm not sure how to feel. Don't you see, Nick? You're finally free. There is no other Nick anymore. Just you. No, I wish it was that easy. But it's not. Because I was Nick Valentine. I had his memories, his fears, all that poor bastard's hope. I remember getting the call to head to some lab in Cambridge to get that neurotrans whatever. And the next thing I know, I'm in a trash heap. My family, my home, my entire life, gone. Then I discover all those things that they weren't even mine. Everything I ever was belonged to Nick. I'd hoped with winter gone, the last hint of that old world snuffed out, I could, I could finally be free. But being out here with you, what I, what I finally realized after all this time was that taking down winter, it wasn't about Nick or Jenny or even you or me. It was about justice, about doing what's right. And that act of goodness, that's ours. All the good we've done, that's ours. And ours alone. And even if Inspiring. that's the only thing in this world that I can ever claim as mine, not Nick's, not the Institute's, but mine, then I can die happy. And none of it would have ever happened if it weren't for you. I'm not sure I'll ever be able to thank you for that. You don't have to, Nick. We're friends. This is what friends do. <laughs> you can't stop being noble now, can you? Well, come on, then. We're not helping anyone standing around here. Yes, close to metal, yeah, Perk. That is, if you're, if you're still interested in traveling together. I wouldn't blame you if you wanted some time on your own after all this. Might be best if we went our separate way. Suit yourself. Guess I'll head on home. Oh. Can I put you to settlement? No? Hey, Valentine. Time to hit the road? Let's head out. Well, all right. Hey. Go ahead. Something I can do? Probably about time we parted ways. Shame. I guess I'll just head home. And I can send him somewhere. Starlight drive in for Nick. I need to do that place up. I have too many of my companions sitting about. Okay, so, well, I've discovered those places, so I can jump back, straight back to the Gwinnett Brewery. Uh, well, time to go get our next companion. You know her, you love her. Next up is... Curie. Do you need something, monsieur? I'd like to travel together some more. Then let us get underway. So, with Curie, we'll do a wee bit of uh, clear night. We'll do a lot of the glow and see with her as well. Let's go to the brewery. We've actually got to go to Fen Finch Farm. So, that's what I'm going to do now. You should have seen the amount of grilled rad, stag, vegetable starch, all that good stuff I made. I'm going to do a wee video on vegetable starch. It'll be a good guide for uh, people trying to get adhesive. I think that's what it kicks into. You only need a few ingredients. Okay, I'm here to help. What am I here to help? You said you needed help and... Let's just get auto-resolve because I've just so yeah. much stuff. Uh, are you set up with the supply line? Because I do have clothes here to send some lucky devil over to County Crossing. Okay. 
Who I'm just going? so hungry all the time. Fantastic. Let's trade. What sure. about you? Be a provisioner. I'll give you a clean black suit and a wee bannered fedora. Equip, equip. Ah, you look dashing. In terms of weapons, I'll have to bring you back something else because you ain't getting any of these. These are my weapons. Uh, so, in that case, I should actually put some of the weapons from provisioners in the workshop. That would make more sense. Anyway, I need to get this set up. Uh, so you'll be the supply line over to Crip Manor. You should know. People have been complaining a bit about Can the we trade a few situation. things? Of course. And we'll give you the other one on a formal hat instead. And we'll send you to County Crossing. Yes. Yes. And that gives us access to two more supply lines. Good job. I'll probably connect Crip up to there just to get it all sorted, but North Hagen will connect over to County Crossing and Bunker Hill connect you all up. But in the meantime, everywhere bar Starlight and Hangman's Alley. Oh, oh no, there's, there's Egrets is a settlement? Didn't know that. Any other settlements about? I think we've unlocked nearly all of them, except Warwick. But we'll get that. And why the Adam Cats isn't one, I'll never know. Okay, let's go back to Gwynna Brewery. Well, we took out all the Marlurks from earlier, so... Doesn't seem like anyone respawned. Let's get right into it. Curie! Be nice to have her insight into things. Oh, we need Cola Quantum. It is! Awesome. Can't wait to see what comments you're going to make. And I don't know what makes her happy. I should have we we Google to see what exactly makes her just mightn't be lock picking. Got it. Yeah, there's no like curry like that. Maybe using drugs or something. That might make her a bit happier. Maybe hacking things? Oh. The return you have loads of company out there, so this terminal unlocked. Thanks to Nick and the Bobblehead, we've just got loads of tries, and I still am unable to do it. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, the good news is we just need one tries reset, and we're good to go again. Hmm. That's it. Good job. Please inform any patrons that are, are, who are without a ticket that they may obtain one by speaking with the host staff from the restaurant. Patrons arriving for a tour more than 10 minutes before the scheduled time should be asked to wait outside. Tours of the craft wing are to be conducted by trained hosts or hostesses every half hour is warranted. Tour of the craft wing includes a seasonal sampler served after the conclusion of the tour. Uh, $59, noon to 8 p.m. Uh, main brewery tours include a craft wing tour, followed by a tour of the main brewing facility located across the inlet. Tours are run every Saturday, Sunday, and some holidays, including the price of a seasonal sampler and a souvenir pint glass. Main tour brewery, $119. Yikes. Also, I think it's the restaurant that they wanted us to clear. Nice. Cool. With the exception of special tours with Master Brewer, all tours will be run by hosting staff from the restaurant, not the brewing employees. Clock in attempt was it failed, or does it say anything? No, it doesn't say anything in it. Door is now open. You guys are going to be a bit of a pain. There so. is something here. Identity unknown. Curry, what I'm more curious about is the fact that. <laughs> Violent pollution can result in a variety of injuries. Well, put cure. Well, yes, it's best to stay up top for a bit. I wonder if I swap out weapons. An 
Courier about to find out. Oh. Did not intend for this. It was not part of the plan. We'll, we'll nip back in to clear the brewery. Was it in fact the brewery they wanted cleared? Trouble brewing? No, 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 no. Yeah. Super Mutants in Gwinnett Brewery. But it's not the brewery. Marlurks here. Not Super Mutants. Hmm. Me thinks there's a problem with that. Yeah, here, you can take care of them. Legendary one pop up. The standard one. Did I see a legendary one? No! I'm an idiot. Why did I do that? There must be more to all this. Well, not more to it, but. What's the. Ah. one joy the joy of wealth Ooh, some pretty good items yeah, we'll crack this then the terminal then the restaurant that's actually a pretty good way to clear it out brewing systems system malfunction we're just going to use the main control console and the rooftop pods for the time being till I can get a technician out here. I've tried everything. The main OS seems to be operating correctly and I've checked the full length of the wired connections. They're fine too, but it can't seem to connect to the brewing vats. I swear I haven't had this much trouble since I tried hooking up a printer at home. <laughs> right. Roof vats. Mention something about the roof. Must be access to it then. Anything on top of all these? No. I can drop down to here. Which might provide me with more information. Huzzah! The roof. Oh, that is a wee outdoor area. Is there a way up here? I'm not seeing it. Ah! No way there's ones on the roof. Couldn't be. Can't open it from this side. This 
Visual contact broken. Continue to fill this is not advised. Well, that legendary has dropped something that I need. I'm still not confu I'm still confused as to the clearing of super mutants at the brewery. And there's no sweet mutants. Either the task gets completed. Uh, they're definitely talking. It must be referring to the restaurant. Imagine being trapped in with nothing but beer and lager and eel. That's either some people's nightmare or some people's dream of how they go out. The brewing systems, uh -huh. Scheduled delivery was to uh, the Shamrock Tap House. Okay. Hotel Rexford. Uh huh. Dead red coat eel. Why do you not see any of these in game? Peabody Fizzler. Uh, or Pilsler, so, something like that. Deliveries continue in off-season and out-of-town games to ensure supplies are sufficient. Deliveries are to be made at 5 a.m. sharp to the main entrance. Ballpark staff are responsible for moving the kegs. And then delivery permit and deliveries are made through the alleyway. Speak with proprietor for key. It's been a few weeks since the bombs fell. My eyesight has come back a bit, but my hearing is still gone. Everything has gone to ship. We holed up in the restaurant for a while, but when looters broke in yesterday and Melissa locked herself in the utility closet, I managed to pop the grating off the pipe in the craft wing and get out to the main brewery. Now I'm trapped up here on the roof. I don't know much longer. I can hold out. And we've got a brewing recipe for none other than you guessed it. The, uh... Oh. If I trap myself? Oh. Of course not. Why is everything so dangerous? <laughs> You're getting first hand experience of it, Curie. Everything up here is dangerous. Everything up here is actively trying to kill us. I don't know what they were fighting. Probably furls. Anyway. Like a Call of Duty game, I'm in the wrong side of the map. <laughs> I'm going to be in these guys in just a quick second. Still trying to kill Curie. To be fair, she never gave up on trying to kill these. Does increasing a, a damage with a more withdrawal effects or something? <laughs> nice. Did you fall off the roof? Where'd he go? He didn't fall off the roof, did he? No. Huh? What? Oh, he fell for a bit back. What were you fighting? Show me the bodies. Nothing of use in here. Oh, it actually was Raiders. Oh, they took out a few things before getting absolutely pummeled. Okay, let's go clear the rest of these mutants out. Ew. Oh, there is to be fighting. Oh, I am in combat yeah. again. <laughs> Almost another full level. Keeping this up. We'll be level 100 in no time. Why is it saying 93 that way? It is. It's referring to the Gwinnett restaurant, not the brewery, but it just says in the quest thing, brewery. It's strange, but... It's all good. Let's go clear it out. We know Claire's in the closet somewhere, so we'll find her too. What? Who's there? Uh -oh. Out there. Somewhere. Oh. Maybe I 
Let's just run through clearing this place out. He gave me 189 X XP. What? This is no game, human! We win! You die! Oh, there's another entrance. Of course the one shouting is like just a standard one, not an overlord, not a butcher, just standard. I do not see them anymore. Oh, there's gas in here. Combat it would have happened as Curie would have come in and set that off. At least I can observe battlefield. Yeah, they were also having to deal with these monarchs. Another settlement joins the ranks. Awesome. Well, Curry, that was uh, that was an interesting one. Heads up. Have gone through extensive quality control. Would you like one? Yeah. Your thoughts? If I may be of assistance, you have but to ask. So, how are we doing, Curie? I find these traveling arrangements quite acceptable. That's good. Okay. Now we know about all that. Door open. So, obviously, you must come out here. Made the connection of where we are. Dead end. This gets us out. That's falling through the floor because the test of things. Is this worth anything? This world of Balkan is very confusing. <laughs> it is fairly confusing. Can I craft anything? I suppose I'm not at my... Not at home. Cotton fluid will be something we'll have to get quite a few or quite a bit of. The bar terminal? Uh, hole in the kitchen wall. Employees, please take notice that we will have contractors in the first week of November to repair the kitchen wall. Hosts, guiding tours through the craft and seasonal wing must require all patrons to wear headgear until repairs are complete. Beer prices. Standard, seasonal. Holy crap. Current bar tabs. Samuel J. and M. Murdoch, McMurdoch. Nearly $100 between them. Actually, pretty impressive. Ooh. Don't know where the elevator's gonna take us. Oh, is there maybe a roof? Exciting. Let's go, Curry. To the roof. Door. Oh. This literally took me down a floor. That's it. It's all dead. Thought it was gonna take me to some new wonderful place, but no. I suppose it did kind of run through this place. We'll just pick up whatever's left. Yes. <laughs> this is, I'm assuming you're Claire. Or was it Claire? Whatever the name was. Mm, 
Okay. <laughs> that couple must have had a few beer too many. God, I love hot plates. Copper and circuitry. Can't beat it. Big slabs of ramen meat. And probably whatever else they try to, uh, to eat here. Alright. Well, that looks like the place has been finished. Just check it out, make sure I left nothing in the bar area. Oh, looks pretty empty to me. Seems good. Oh, there's more. And Super Mutant Arm Guards. I wonder how much Curie can carry. Just like overall. Must be a fair amount. Let's, uh, let's beat it out of here. Straight out and just explosions. <laughs> She's just gonna have to go the long way around. Oh! Hi guys, so look at it this way. Was easy. I think they try to extort you if you don't sneak up on them, or if you do sneak up on them. Obviously, yeah, <laughs> they didn't get much extortion out of us. Again, somewhere that should have been the settlement is the rifts up here. Way. Watch out for that one, Kerry. <laughs> like this just seems like a neat place. Pretty good with the rooftops. Could set up a good wee camp here. I suppose they And look, even though the AI doesn't do too well with staircases, I mean, isn't the problem kind of solved because of the fact they can't get down? I just keep the settlement up. That's it. Okay, whilst we are here. We do have the general atomics to do. Is that a gate? No. Well, there's a legendary raider about here. I mean, there was. Oh no, this is the good. Silly me. I'm on the wrong side of the street. What the fuck was that? Shoot him! Shoot him all! So it's not of much use to me, but I will take it nonetheless. You're still alive. Oh. That's the one that actually got injured by the Brotherhood in the last uh, run that we were here. Well, can we get into the school? I've never been in here. It's a good time as any to go have we snoopy snoop. Let's go. What secrets do ye hold? I have seen pictures of that. Yeah, we protect her. Heads up. Trade is good. Well, the good news is you don't seem to mind carrying just about everything, so. What? She carries some serious amount of goods. T 
250 carry weight she's got. More or less. Not slightly less, but still pretty good. Yeah, marble statue. Well, remains one anyway. some wild sights in here like this doesn't seem to have any raiders in it though wow this is a really small location if this is indeed all of it that's wild That is this place done. Picture frames got. Let's get out of here. Whilst I'm here, I should just go and discover the castle. I mean, I'm really close to it. Also, this is the L Bathhouse. Indeed, an unmarked location. Containing... Eh, you guessed it. Marlurks. Ooh, don't wanna... Do, whoa, 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 whoa. Let's just talk about this. one of my most hated enemies to a little more than a pushover. Oh! I was like, that, that dealt a wee bit more damage than I would have thought. Get back here! Took up all that meat, because idiot Savant is just brilliant for it. <laughs> Getting overwhelmed there, Kiri. <laughs> I'll right, just collect all the meat. Is the old bathhouse done? Here. I wonder what killed these scavengers. I thought it was the rat roaches. But, then again, you never know. I will admit, though. Okay. Curry! Mare! Mm, that was my bad. I'll own up to it. <laughs> Shouldn't have maybe sent you into that.
definitely think the next episode will go about reclaiming the castle. Huh. I thought there, there's more items up here. There's nothing. Well, by the looks of it, there's nothing. Nope, nope. I can confirm there is nothing. Okay, well, I just spawned out of the game. Okay, so I see in the distance the castle. It is the next thing to conquer. And then, of course, there's the Pudwin. We've got to do Dance's quest from the Cambridge Police Station. Kind of left him alone a good while. Things time. Go over, say, hey, Dance. Let's go to Arc Jet, sort all that out. Should actually nip over to Arc Jet first. Because I think it changes when you do the quest. Anyway, this has been fun. See you all in the next one. Thank you for watching.